Howdy folks, this is Jared of Flutie Lake Homestead. And today, me and Finley's been out here in the barn and we're doing a little bit of cleaning. Um, since I don't use this hayloft anymore for hay, I've been uh, sweeping it out and uh, cleaning it up and trying to organize some wood I've got stored here. And uh, we're gonna turn the most of this barn into a workshop. I'm gonna box in the hallway and uh, we're gonna organize all my tools in it and I set up all my saws and stuff and uh, that way I can use this space for something more important than just a, a shed and I'm going to save the big stall uh, that way I can put a cow a horse or whatever I want to in it and uh, I mainly been using it for a birthing stall or if I need to put the horse in there to work on his feed or something and I've got the cap in there now but the rest of the barn has just been the catch-all for me and uh, I'm not the most organized person but this year I'm gonna try to get organized on everything I got. So first project has been cleaning this barn out and I'll show you as I go along and get things organized. And uh, when I get the wood, we're gonna really try to uh, get my tools uh, functional and where I can get to them. So I'm gonna keep on cleaning and uh, see what we can do. Right now we're gonna, um, I'm throwing this old wood out. So we can put it in the bird pile. Yep, we're cleaning out the barn, ain't we, Finn? Yeah. We've been trying to organize oh, and clean. Yeah, there. throw it down there so we don't step on it. Since we don't use this barn for hay anymore, and we just need the stall, we're going to clean it out and uh, organize all of our tools in here. Yeah. Good job, Finn. Yep, we gotta take our metal out to the metal pile. Well, we've got some of our wood organized here. I'm trying to put everything that's alike together. And it opened up my floor a lot. And I took the leaf blower and blew all the dust out. And I don't really use this for any hay now that we do round bales. So we're gonna use it for a workshop and tools. And uh, I've been going through some of this stuff here. I've got some tomato cages there I need to get out. And I've uh, kind of just put all my old plows in a corner. And those are all the ones I want to keep. I sold all the ones I wanted to get rid of to uh, my friend Eric. Um, I've saved a little, uh, I think it's a six inch pony plow. I've got a Lynchburg 50 turning, a hillside turning plow I saved. Then I think there's a two double shovels i've got and i've got a uh, wood beam plow here that i made then i've got my grandpa's old bull tongue plow right there that he used to plow his garden and tobacco bed with down in jackson county and uh that's all i need i didn't need all the ones i had so we thinned down a little bit been trying to go through on this side and uh got it all swept out and uh Got a few more things to get rid of on top of my crib. It's been kind of a catch-all as well. But I'm going to put a lot of uh, boxes of stuff up there. I'm just trying to get um, things cleaned up around here. And I'm going to try to go through some of my junk. And if I ain't used it in the last few years, I'm going to try to get rid of a few things. Well, we got this room tidied up a little bit. This is the crib. Got all our saddles and harness in place and uh, got some of our hand tools hung and some odds and ends cleaned up out of the floor. And I'm going to keep this as my feed room and keep uh, a lot of my animal related stuff in here. And uh, I've been out here tidying up now. Um, this is that middle stall that I, I raised a calf in. And I'm probably going to put me some uh, lights and shelves in here and put some of my tools up and then we got to bring the tractor been burning some old scrap wood and feed bags and got to get this fertilized spreader out old Finn's out shooting his red rider you like shooting BB guns Finn? This one I had broke. Yeah, it jammed up, didn't it? We tried to fix it. But 
We have another one back at the house. Yep. Well, I about got things tidied up for the day. And uh, one of the next projects we got on the barn here is I've got some wood ordered to box these uh, walls in here behind me. And I got some old windows. I'm going to put three windows in and build a barn doors on the front and door on the back. And uh, we'll uh, get all our tools organized. And uh, I ain't had my, all my tools organized in one place in my life, I don't think. So I'm going to try to make this the year of organization. So I'll take you along as we work on this barn and uh, show you the progress as we go. We got the forks on the tractor, moving some hand tools and stuff to the barn from the building. What's your opinion? Can a man have too many tools? Right there, out of one building, I think I see four of the same kind of shovel. Is there such a thing as too many hand tools? I don't know. Tell me what you think. Appreciate y'all watching. Hope you have a very blessed day.